It's a tree that predates the founding of the United States. One tree near Charleston brings in hundreds of thousands of visitors every year. Our Will Volk takes us to the Angel Oak Tree for this week's One Tank Trip. People love coming here. I'm here about 200 days a year. Frank DeLoach sets up his easel near the tree all the time and paints pictures of it. The small one is good if you have young He meets folks. a lot of new people every day. It's like working in the airport. <laughs> I love it. I love it. It's very stimulating. I talk to people about art and dinosaurs and all kinds of stuff all day long. Every year, more than 400,000 people visit the angel oak tree. Estimates say it's between 400 and 500 years old. It's hard to put in perspective just how big this tree is until you see it for yourself. Its branches go out way past the trunk, which itself has a circumference of 28 feet. The tree is more than 60 feet tall. I remember like 1954 being here with my cousins from Jacksonville. And I can remember we stayed here and slept in our sleeping bags under the tree. Deloach has been coming back ever since. And over the last couple decades, he's turned these paintings into a job. I never, never planned on it being quite this successful. I've been doing it 23 years and, and it, these are very popular, these big paintings. Popular paintings of one popular tree. On John's Island, Will Volk, on your side. And it's free to visit the Angel Oak. Again, that's on John's Island, a little more than 10 miles away from downtown Charleston.